Okay. Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel. So today you won't be seeing my face, but you will be seeing my bullet journal. As you can see by the title, uh, I'm going to be showing you my March bullet journal setup. So without further ado, let's go. So as you guys know, uh, March is my birthday month. So for the main spread, I chose to uh, write March 2020 in uh, glagolitic letters. And uh, then I just added a bunch of things that I like, like uh, flowers represent representing spring, Disney, Tolkien, Harry Potter, Friends, Doctor Who, uh, cats, <laughs> and uh, vintage things. And also these three are actually representing London, Paris, and New York, places that I definitely want to visit. So this month I uh, skipped monthly spread because I didn't use it in past few months, so I didn't see the reason to continue with it. So the first actually spread that I did is uh, Grateful Vibes. So this is where I'm going to be writing what I'm grateful for each day. And uh, at the end I wrote a little quote, Gratitude is the fairest blossom which springs from the soul by Henry Ward uh, Beecher. And then uh, this month I did my habit tracker with uh, stickers. I um, found a very cute picture with a calendar online and then I added it uh, a little bit in um, a LibreOffice writer and uh, then I printed them out and uh, wrote each of my habits as a title. And. Uh, like last month, I also made a spread where I'm going to be writing which movies I watched, which TV shows I watched, which music I've been listening to, which games I've been playing, and which books I've been reading. And the one thing that I added is uh, who I went to coffee with or who I need to go to coffee with. Like, basically, this is just going to be a short list of people that I want to spend time with. This is uh, gonna be my march to read list so these are gonna be books that i want to read um and uh, on my on here is gonna be the books that i've already read that i've finished reading so that's my to read list then on instagram last month or for february i did 30 day water challenge uh, so i actually printed out the same picture as a sticker and uh, put it on here so that I can still continue to track my uh, water that way. Then I added this. Uh, since I do love teas very very much, I uh, added these two uh, spreads, which as you can see they're the same. But on this side I will write uh, teas that I've uh, tried, that, that, I, yeah, that I've tried regardless of whether I like them or not. And uh, here I'll add some teas that I want to try. And this is my uh, productivity tracker. Uh, this is how I did it this month. Uh, I didn't have time to do it by hand, so I uh, did it on my PC. And then I printed it out as a, as a sticker. So it's the same as last month. The only thing that I accidentally made a mistake, I forgot to add rows on this side. Uh, so for 29th, 30 and 31st, I will have to kind of improvise when the time comes. But other than that, I actually really like it and I'm looking forward to filling it out again. And these are my weeklies. Uh, same, I did them on my PC, but I actually did these in uh, December. Um, and uh, now I've, I'm finally using it. <laughs> so just simple Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday and notes. On the notes section I'll actually do um, my YouTube and blog ideas and things that I need to do for that week for YouTube and blog. So yeah, that's pretty much it for uh, this video. The last thing that I have is treasure thoughts, uh, like the brain dump page, so anything that doesn't go anywhere in here, it'll go here. So that's actually it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, let me know if you like it. You can show off your 
pleasure ideas also and uh, that's it see you next time bye bye